Okay, so I need to go to the library or wherever there's books, I guess. <laughs> Every time I see that post, I think it's a person standing there. Can I go out the front door? Whoa. <laughs> That's cool, I've never seen that before. That was actually really cool. I like. Good job, Capcom. So, <sighs> so yeah, there's something I missed. There's a red book that. Oh. oh gosh. Um, I remember getting a red book, but I opened it and it was blank pages. So. in here because i don't think i have one here okay i need to figure out where his office where the that, that office is here we go there's a light switch For some reason, did I just not pick this up? <laughs> Why did I not pick that up? So now I can go back. I still have the ink ribbon in my thing. <coughs> so you know, this part here reminds me of Code Veronica. I played a lot of Code Veronica back in the day. Okay, that's that one's good. What this one? That one doesn't have one apparently. And this one is where this goes. Yeah. Oh. Oh no. Ooh. I, I, I'm not, I, I wasn't doing that. I love it, sorry. If I have to, I can come back or reset the game. If all else fails. music sounds creepy. Oh, now I'm in the laboratory. There's a ladder here, or a door. I'll try the door first. First class emergency. Okay, so down the ladder we go. Item box? Uh oh. <laughs> uh. Okay. Um. Just in case, I'm gonna grab the python. 
And where's the magnum rounds? Especially since there's no... What's it called here? Typewriter? And that worries me. That, that really worries me, actually. She scared me. What's this? Is that another disc? It is a disc. Why are there so many down here? But once I use the discs, I'll have room, but, like, what are the discs for? What is that? His arm's gone. What's this? Ooh. This one. Oh, I just didn't think of it over here. <laughs> um, wait, what's this story? Please be a safe room. Thank you. And a map. Researcher's letter. June 8th, 1998. Dear Ada. Wait, what? Ada, by the time you read this, I'll be something different. Today's test turned out to be positive, just as I expected. I feel like going crazy when I think about becoming one of, one of them. Ada, you're not infected, and I hope you never will be. 
In case you're the last one left, take the material in the visual data room and go to the power room to operate the triggering system before you escape. And make all the public through the media all this public through the media. If everything is in order, all the locks can be opened by the security system. You can access the system if you log in with my name from the terminal in the small lab and enter the password. The password is your name. To lock the door at B2, where the visual data room is located, you'll need to access... You'll need to access with our names... You'll need access with our names first and then enter another password. Uh, <laughs> I've written the code below. I'm sure you'll understand it easily. And this is my last hope. If you find me completely changed, please kill me yourself. Password equals Nordic Runes. Yours, John. So... John Ada. Hmm. Can move this. Oh. Tree, apple, man, woman. Tree, apple, man, woman. I don't know what you're referring to. What is this? Ooh. Yes, please. More. <gasps> There's more. <laughs> Aww. See, my reflection in the mirror is creepy. Turn this light off. Man, tree, apple, man, and woman. <gasps> oh! Okay, okay, okay. So, files. Okay, so M with an X, a fish standing up, <laughs> a little hook thing, and an M. Okay, that's clever. So M with an X is an M. M O. Wait. Mole. Ooh. I don't want that that one just says max in runes. Wait, so there's a mole? Well, I mean that was obvious, but I wanna put the discs back. And then come back and grab everything, because I don't want to leave this stuff behind. I'll put it here. Grab that other disc and come back here too. Don't do that when I open the door.
grab one of these and eat it. Just to heal. There you go. Wait, the other one's here. Oh, I need to get that ink ribbon too. Slappy feet. I'm guessing they don't die. Oh, wait, the ink ribbon's in here. Maybe I should try to shoot their heads off. Up would do it, but I guess not. <laughs> what? I thought I did. Okay, that actually got him. Good. However, door's tightly locked. What about this one? Okay, this one opens. Oh, the slides. Huh. Nothing special. There's, there's a test tube things. Yeah, not, nothing useful is more accurate, but say nothing special. Come on. It's like an incubator here. Oh, her hands. Oh, is this what I need the discs for? Umbrella. Okay. She said, John, Ada. And mole? 
Is that right? Dang it. Oh, dang it. There we go. There we go. Okay, cool. B3? Nice. Okay, where do I go now? Oh, I got the map. What? Well, I guess I go back up to B2 and work my way down. This game is very, very well made. And like this, the horror and like the scare is very, very good. It's very creepy and scary. Even the jump scares. Phone? Marker board? There's a panel. Will you open it? Yes. Mind if I yes? What's this? Uh oh. Security system. Basement level one. Helicopter report. Or helicopter port. Executives and government officials only on helicopter port. Government officials? Yikes! Okay, so. In. Resident Evil Degeneration. That is the first CGI Resident Evil film that is canon to the video games. Um, they mentioned something in there about government, the US government officials being involved with Umbrella and basically being behind the atrocity or like the tra tragedy of Raccoon City, more or less. Like basically the US government basically like knew what they were doing and funded them and this kind of confirms that this restriction may not apply in a in case of an accident passage to the helicopter uh passage to the helicopter no one is allowed to enter unless they are attended by a research consultant or security director all others will be shot on site right the elevator stops doing emergencies uh, basement level 2. Visual data room is within the control of Special, special Research Division um, Keith Arving. The room manager is designated to have jurisdiction over room usage. Prison. Oh. Sanitation Division controls the usage of the prison. Consultant researchers E. Smith, R. Ross, A. Wesker. Must be present if virus is used. Triple lock door. E. Okay, so this confirms that there was a, a Wesker, or is a Wesker, that was part of this. And Albert Wesker seems the most likely candidate. No one is allowed to enter unless he presents all passcode documents. Passcode documents must be created on a specialized 
output machine by the chief researcher of each block. Only headquarters supervisors may enter. HQ supervisor may enter. This restriction may not apply if the consultant researcher has received special instructions. Uh, passcode? No one is allowed to use the passcode output machine but the chief researchers. Basement 4. Regarding the progress of Tyrant, after the use of the T-Virus, the remaining document is unreadable. Uh-oh. Well, Joe, there you go. You figured out what Wesker is really doing here. Of course, I don't have the stupid reels. Oh, there it goes. Bioweapon materials. Oh, they even say it. MA39 Cerberus. Oh. FI3 Neptune. That is a one massive shark. See, oh, there it is, the hunters. MA121 Hunter. T002 Tyrant. That's not good. There's Wesker! <laughs> uh. Bioweapon Research Institute R&D staff? Oh no. Well, we have visuals. We have visual evidence of Wesker being part of it. We have both written and visual evidence. Oh, I used them. Okay, I don't need to go back. What <laughs> Wesker's just sitting there? <laughs> well, that's it's confirmed. Wesker is a villain. Uh, where do I go? Where am I? Oh, this this door first then, because it's closer. Where to now? To the... This way? Oh, okay. It was locked earlier. Oh, because of the computer. The... the, the... Oh, hi. Ah! Oh gosh, there's a lot of you. <laughs> I hope I don't have to fight the tyrant because tyrant is one scary boss. Facts. To General Manager of Sanitation Division from Special Committee of Disasters Raccoon Special Research Department. Um, this memorandum is strictly confidential and must be destroyed as soon as it is understood. Okay. Regarding the T-virus outbreak, which occurred recently, this committee conducted a field survey. According to the survey results, estimated on the amount, estimates on the amount of damage, damage caused by the accident are considerably greater than reported earlier. First, although it is very difficult to obtain accurate data in terms of actual numbers, it is thought that more than half of the researchers died after exposure to the T-Virus. The body count will most likely increase since nearly all of the survivors show symptoms peculiar to the T-Virus. Second, our security system is still in operation. However, a special security guard, a special security guard squad has been nearly destroyed. Because of that, 
research information considered by our company to be top secret has been made available to outsiders. Ooh. Countermeasures should be taken as soon as possible. Finally, many of the subjects, quote unquote subjects, from the experiment have escaped and are out of control. Yeah. I, I, I would say so. <laughs> we believe that some researchers were killed by these subjects and their bodies were mutilated. By curious co coincidence, these events are proof of the success of our, our research. However, there is also a very high risk that this news may be leaked to the press if we don't act immediately. The condition is very serious. Our operation to cover up the situation is difficult to attain. However, we may hope we hope the problem will be solved quickly. We are especially concerned that the state police and stars I think that stands for a special tactics special tactics and rescue service are intervening too quickly. We need to act on this situation as well. And that's kind of where Wesco came in, I, I suppose. <laughs> if he's working for Umbrella. Most of them are fiction books. I have f three of them, three or four of them. So I need to go back and get them? I have three of them. Pass code one. Genesis 2226. I swear by myself, declares the Lord, that because you have done this and have not withheld your son, your only son, Twenty two sixteen, not twenty six. That, that looks like a twenty six. Okay. Why do I have two more? I need to look everywhere for three separate passwords. Okay. Oh, there's a room in the middle? Did not even realize. Oh yeah, there is. Derp. Oh, I can't do it. Oh gosh, that scared the crap out of me. Oh man. I don't know if I want to. I can't save it either. Dang it, I, 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 I can't save it. <laughs> oh. There's an elevator here. Wait, so am I, am I just trying to get to the the helipad? The uh, the uh the thingy. Ooh. About time I get more shotgun shells. <laughs> Great. Great. Oh, crap. I saw that, but I didn't mean to step on it. I was gonna go over there and push it, but, you know. Can I push anything in the way?
Wait, is that a gas mask? Oh. Okay, I need to reset everything, I guess. Ooh. It's been a while since I've seen a red herb. Yeah, I'll, I'll reset the room. So I think... How do they navigate around this room? up or oh, maybe it over a little bit there we go I'm not trying not to push it too much because I don't want it to trigger the button. <laughs> there we go. I go if I enter it. Oh, well, I'll go into the other room. Cool. Oh, no. I see shiny. Nice. Why did it give me those, though? Ooh. Passcode 2. Genesis 2227. I will surely bless you and make your descendants as numerous as the stars in the sky and as the sound or as and as the sand on the seashore. Your descendants will take possession of the cities of their enemies. Was that talking? Was he talking about Abraham? There. I don't remember. It's been a while since I've read the Bible. <laughs> Ooh. 
See, some of these are coming back to life. Did I go in there? I did. Okay, I don't want to go in the elevator. I need to go in here first. Oh, <gasps> yes. Ooh, thank you. Sweet. Safe spot. Ooh, herbs too. Nice. Uh, yes. I was gonna hit no, but I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead. Yee! Oh, there's a whole new section in there. Okay, well, I'll go over here first, then. But yeah, there's no way- I don't think there's any way in any video game. Whoa, what the heck is that? Ah! What are these things? Ow! <laughs> My goodness. Not only did that, does this noise scare me, but then I'm greeted by freaking Mr. Hands over here. Oh. Should I have done that? There's only one door forward. Okay. That's like a little machinery boiler room or whatever. Yikes. What is that noise? What is that noise? Oh! What is this? Oh! And free inventory space. Passcode number three. Genesis 2215? 18. He is talking about Abraham. Wait, so... The guy who started all this, does he see himself as Abraham? And through your offspring, all nations on earth will be blessed because you have obeyed me. Yeah, does this guy... Oh, hello. Run this way. 
Turn around. Ah! Run. <laughs> Jeez. This... Uh, where am I going? Wait. Oh. Oh, there's a big door here. I didn't even see that. Oh gosh, why is there more noise? What's this? There's two computers. Ah. What about this computer? Okay, so the elevator is working, I guess. I had no idea it wasn't working the first time. It sounds like a lawnmower. <laughs> or a weed eater. <laughs> Is that an earth? Okay, get an earth. It's not. Oh, thank goodness. Ooh, I have a choice. Go down the elevator or take use the passcode. Wait, is this where we're going to see the tyrant for the first time? Jill? Is that you, Jill? Oh, Chris, you're alive! <gasps> it's Chris! Of course. Damn it, we're in quite a predicament, Jill. I know, Chris. Anyway, I have to open this room. Chris, what are you doing in there? It doesn't work. Well, Chris, I'll be sure to come back and help you soon. Will you wait here? Thanks. I'll be waiting here for you. <laughs> what else is he going to do? Okay. Now, this will determine... This actually- okay, so I'm gonna say this now. I do know that there are multiple endings for this. And... Getting Chris out, or leaving Chris in there, or Jill, or wh whoever... That'll determine- that determines the ending. From what I've read, all you need to do is have those three things, and then you can save Chris. Like. After this, then it's like the final boss fight, so apparently it, the final boss is like right here. It's like right around the corner, which I had a feeling it was. So I'm excited and I'm also terrified because <laughs> I still don't know what the final boss is. I, ha I have a feeling it's going to be either Wesker or a tyrant because they keep there because I keep hearing about the tyrant in this. And I haven't seen it except in that one picture, so we'll see. So I just need to run back 
after the final after the boss from my understanding uh so yeah i need to go to the save room save and prepare for the final battle <laughs> oh i'm nervous i'm excited though Go ahead and use this. I'm going to do something stupid and not bring any first aid. Let me do this right. 55, 30, 24. There you go, jeez. <laughs> I forgot how to use the ink ribbon, I guess. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm, I'm super nervous. Yeah, I'm gonna use the python. Oh, oops. Because, like say if it's Wesker, I can take him out very easily with a python. But if it's like a creature, I gotta do a lot of damage with a python, but I probably won't finish it with a python. Actually, I don't imagine I would be, I would finish it with a python. I thought it. I. Oh, okay. Oh my goodness. There you go. Jill. Oh, hi, Barry. Jill, you're here too. Yes, you're here too. Look. I lost my way. Let's get going. <laughs> they do a good job of trying to make Barry sus at the beginning. Or towards the middle. Um, it's almost like a whodunit type of thing until you get to, like, the, to the very end. I mean, we're about to figure out who it was, I guess. But then, like, with... What's his name? Enrico? Or Richard? I think it's Enrico. You've... Wesker. Ooh. You did a fine job, Barry. Just as I thought. I think you should stay away from Barry, Jill. I hear that his wife and two daughters will be in danger if he doesn't do everything I tell him to. Oh, you no. so cruel. Well, you don't have to worry about anything. Because you'll be free from this world very soon, Jim. Why do you have to destroy stars? That's Umbrella's intention. This laboratory has been engaging in dangerous experiments. Recently, an accident has occurred. Anyway, this disaster cannot be made public. That's why having stars know what about is so inconvenient. So you're a slave of Umbrella now, along with these virus monsters. I think you misunderstand me, Joe. To me, the monsters you mentioned... Barry, you can easily them. turn and shoot I'm him. I'm going to burn all of them together with this entire laboratory. I must complete my mission as ordered by Umbrella. Barry, go up on the ground and wait there. Barry! Oh, you can know he feels bad. Barry's such a fool. He'll be under the control of Umbrella forever. How come both Umbrella and you intimidate him by taking his family as hostages? I mean, that's very easy Umbrella. to do, Joe. <laughs> well, I intimidated him, but it had nothing to do with Umbrella. I just used him for my personal purposes. Though both you and Barry seem to think I was following orders from Umbrella. So you're planning something else? If you succeeded in developing the world's most powerful biological weapon, what would you do? What if you were in charge? You must stop this now. You're a brave girl. But if I were you, I wouldn't give up such a big discovery. You guys are idiots. No one understands its real value. So, you're going to steal all the research? Better yet, I'm going to show you the tyrant. Oh no! <laughs> Yes! 
scary. Sorry, Jill. How is your family? Uh, I was listening to what you and Wesker were talking about. I wish I realized it earlier. I thought it must have something yes. to do with Umbrella. So it's all been masterminded by him. But it's good that you know that now. Anyway, let's get out of this, this house first. This music. <laughs> Jill! Yes, what? Do you have any idea what Wesker was going to show you at the back of this place? Well, he was talking about the world's most powerful biological weapon. Called Tyrant or something, I, I think. Do you think we could see Tyrant now? Barry, you're so optimistic. It would look bad for stars if we let such a dangerous creature run loose. Maybe you're right. True. Let's go then. But it might kill us. <laughs> I don't want to. I mean, I got the python, so. Ooh. Uh, Barry's like, what? Oh. Ooh. That looks scary. So that's the first model tyrant? Ooh, it's exposed heart. Yeah. I've, I've, I've seen those pictures be before. Oh. It's alive. Can a creature like this really be the ultimate biological weapon? Really? Wesker is a crazy man. Tyrant is not completely developed. But we can't let it live. That must be the computer for monitoring this creature. Did you, did you just drain it? <laughs> You're gonna wake him up. Barry, what are you doing? Uh-oh. Now you've done it, Barry. Damn you! Ooh! What it does. Ow. Uh oh. Ow. Dang, that's it. Just three hits. Nah, he's not bleeding. I don't trust it. Barry. Barry? Barry? Okay, you're alive. You're Good. Alive. <laughs> I'm really embarrassed. I was clumsy. Let's get going. I'm really embarrassed. I was clumsy. That's. Once anything. Okay. Now I need to go back to Chris. Is that right? Is Wesker there? Oh, Wesker's gone. What happened to Wesker? The triggering system has now been. Wesker must have set it off. There's not much time left for us. Oh crap. Where do I go after this? <laughs> I need to find I need I need to get Chris, obviously. So I think the Python was probably a little too OP for the Titans. <laughs> So 
So, am I just running out of the front door? Is that what I'm doing? Oh, wait. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? The crystal did, did crystal did, did oh gosh hi <laughs> Doesn't crystal disappear though Does it say all creatures and guards or all researchers? I think researchers Chris Everything is done? Well, almost, yes. Now let's go. Is it gonna just um, automatically teleport me, or do I still have to run for my life? Oh, I still have to run for my life. Oh, come on, Chris, don't get stuck behind a wall. <laughs> So yeah, I think the python was a little too OP. <laughs> Sorry, Capcom. Ooh, hi. Ooh. Oh, hi. Oh, this music is awesome. Let's go. Okay, I want to do something real quick, though. And I'm going to take this. I'm going to take both of these just in case I end up dying. <laughs> Or in case I end up getting hurt more. <laughs> hey, all three of them. Oh, this door opens. I can't, I can't do that, I guess. Ooh. Okay. Use this. Give me the battery. <laughs> oh, there's a phone there. Oh crap. T minus three minutes. Oh no. Oh no, you must 
be kidding. After you've come all the way here. Ladies first. Go first, Jill. But Chris. Give me a chance to play nice guy. <laughs> what? Oh wait, is that the tyrant or is that Wesker? Oh, I, I, I didn't do anything. <laughs> I still have the python. I'm basically using Barry's gun, I think. Oh. Ooh, what's this? Oh! <gasps> I survived, I think. Ooh. Oh no, am I, am I, is he gonna crush me? <laughs> I'm right in the middle of the pad. This lands on Jill. It's game over. <laughs> Jill, you may want to move a little bit. It is the tyrant. Oh, jeez. Uh-oh. Ah! Oh! Yikes. Ah! Oh! Okay. It's coming! Jill! Kill that monster! Through our Amazon, Jill! Wait, what is that? Ooh. Ah! I made my to it! Well done. I survived. <gasps> Live action stuff, yay. Yay! Dang! That was a good game! Yeah, see, so, so some of these cutscenes I didn't get because of the timing of when I did them. That snake, though, that was that was cool. That was one of the cooler parts of the game. Yeah, see, oh, I didn't get that either. Interesting.
This is such an anime song. <laughs> Opening theme is terror, ending theme still done. Presented by Capcom. Resident Evil. <laughs> ten and a half hours? Okay, so it's like a ten hour game. Cool. I feel like all the all the actors and actresses were perfect for the characters they played. And I mean that initially is what influenced the game's later designs, like uh Code Veronica and um like Barry's look has always been based on this guy. Same with Wesker. Chris, his look changed with Resident Evil 5, which I think is more iconic than his original look. And then Jill, of course. Like her look also changed with uh technically five, but more so with Um Revelations 1. The special key. Ooh. It unlocks that room. Oh, I double hit on IT. Wow. I had a crap ton of fun playing this this is one of the best games i have played especially on the ps1 um like i had a crap ton of fun i had there were definitely good scares in this and i'm glad i finally played it after all these years leave down in the comments what you guys thought of this playthrough what you guys think I did wrong or what you guys think I did right or what I could have done better be sure to share this playthrough with your friends on Facebook Twitter uh, even discord if the server if the servers you're part and allow it um, even Instagram if that is a thing that you can do I don't know how, how Instagram works <laughs> still um, make sure to like it Make sure to get subscribed if you haven't, if you really enjoyed this series. I highly enjoyed it. Um, plus, I'm a huge Re Resident Evil fan. Um, <laughs> so it was a win-win. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys in whatever game I plan on doing next. Until then.